So my name is Manish Mehrotra and we are standing at Indian Accent restaurant at the moment. Today I am going to show you a dish which when I was deciding everybody was against it. Why? Because we were serving moong dal in the fine dining restaurant and charging a bomb for it. Everybody said moong dal, bimar wali dal in a fine dining restaurant like Indian Accent, it will never work. And I believed in that particular dish because since childhood, I was tasting that thing at different parts of Muradabad. It was Dal Muradabadi. So let's go. We'll start with the Dal Muradabadi. Just a normal pan, a little bit of ghee. I always prefer ghee, one of the best cooking medium. My ghee is now hot. One or two cloves, jeera, little bit of hing. One of the unique thing about this particular dish is that this is without onion and garlic. It's just the boiled moong dal, like a nice pasty moong dal. The aroma of hing, jeera, and cloves. I'll add a little bit of ginger and a little bit of green chilies. While boiling the boong dal, I added a little bit of haldi and salt into it. My dal is nice and the aromas are really, really good. A little bit of coriander. It's basically just boiled moong dal and you are putting tarka into it. A little bit of butter, which really gives a smooth and silky texture. You don't have to eat a full bowl. You have to eat a little bit. So this much butter and ghee is, I think, perfect. There is no harm. It's a perfect dal. Dal is almost ready. I'm going to plate it. Now it's time to garnish my dal. I will sprinkle this buklu masala. We specially get it from Unnav. This is a little bit of imli ka chutney. A little bit of dhania and mint ka chutney. A little bit of nimbu. A little bit of onions. Tomato, some crispy moong dal on top, crunch of onions, silkiness of dal, crispiness of moong dal, this and a nice colorful dish, dal muradabadi. <laughs> 